San Diegan Alice Holmeyer turned her youthful fast pitch hobby into a baseball career. At the age of 20, Alice Lefty Holmeyer got the unique chance to play in a professional baseball league. It was an opportunity women players today can only dream of. Lucky for Holmeyer, she was born at just the right time, 1925. During World War II, professional baseball came to a grinding halt with male players being sent overseas. But President Roosevelt turned to the women of America to fill the national pastime gap. Lefty joined the All-American Girls Professional Baseball League in 1946 at its heyday when it was boasting eight teams playing 110 game schedules. And professional ball it was. The women of the AAGPB had to adapt from girls softball to baseball's 80-foot baseline with nine players instead of ten and grueling on-the-road schedules. And they had to live up to society's then idea of feminine, complete with skirts and makeup worn on and off the field. In 1948, Lefty pitched 42 scoreless innings, once got a hit off the great Satchel Paige in an all-star game, and was the only woman in the 55 years and over World Men's Slow Pitch Tournament in 1981. Today, Lefty is invited to speak nationally as an inspiration and was asked to consult on the Gina Davis film, A League of Her Own. The character Rosie O'Donnell played in the film was based on Lefty. Alice Lefty Holmeyer is one of the best known and accomplished veterans of the World War II era All-America Girls Professional Baseball League. And tonight, she will recall those heady days of summer when women played real baseball. Please welcome the 2005 Spirit of the Women's Hall of Fame, Alice Lefty Holmeyer. <laughs>